We're finally at the last episode. I wonder how it's going to end. You know, about this series? I mentioned before how it caught my attention, but I was afraid it might be too scary for me. But I'm glad I watched it. Guess it's important to break out of your comfort zone sometimes. Do you ever try watching things from genres you don't normally get into? Uh... I've been with someone. <laughs> I'm the same way. Isn't it easier to try something new when you have someone with you for the ride? Yeah, or if it's something they care about that I don't necessarily care about, it's fun to have someone else be super enthusiastic about it. It's also nice to be able to comment on it and see the other person's reaction. Watching this together made me realize how much I appreciated the main character. Like how she can't turn a blind eye to people in need and extends her hand to almost anyone. And of course the way she kept pressing forward no matter what happened. It was so inspiring. Come to think of it, isn't she just like you? <laughs> that might be a stretch. Remember how I told you about that girl I was close to who started ignoring me one day? It's like I did anything to make her hate me. We've been friends for a long time, but one day out of the blue, she just said, My mother told me I can't play with you anymore. That's weird. It's because there were rumors flowing around about my parents. Oh. People suck. I kind of get it now, looking back, but at the time, I was just sad. <sighs> what I'm trying to say is... This show made me realize I'd like to be a little more like the main character. I want to be the kind of person who'd help anyone at any time. Someone who's kind and strong. It might be silly to say I look up to a fictional character, but there's no harm in following her example. At least, that's what I think. Yukari has been inspired by the protagonist to sh of the show we watched on DVD. Healing Apex reduces the SP cost and recovery skills to 25% of their normal SP cost. That's okay. Oh! The last episode's starting! That ending was so good! I hope they'll make a sequel. DVDs I'm curious about next time. Oh, it's about time we head back to our rooms. Have a good night, okay? Everyone, listen up. Well, today is the last composition class for January. As they say, January walks and February runs. It'll be a whole new year in a flash. But before that, we've got our final exam, so don't relax just yet. Anyway, just look at me. I manage to come to school every day, so you can too. Even though, if I had the choice, I'd have slept in at home. Too many scary people around town lately. I'm feeling sleepy. Stay awake. Yep. Oh. Whoops. Those apathy syndrome rumors have been all over TV lately. Same with those cult members. How did things end up like this? Well, yesterday I heard something intriguing. Someone on TV called it a disease born out of the times where the darkness in someone's heart completely takes over. They said it's inevitable, 
in a hopeless society like ours, that its victims are really the victims of society at large. But I think that's wrong. Everyone may have darkness in their hearts, but they fight it, right? I admit, hope isn't something you come across so easily in our society, but that hardly gives them license to give up. They should be able to stand on their own two feet. Anyway, that's my take on the matter. I hope you were paying attention, class. Something profound like that is bound to show up on the final exam. Okay. All right, class is over. No, does Fuka not want to hang out? Am I not going to get to finish Fuka right at the very end here? Is that Fuka or is that um, student council girl? No, that's student council girl. Well, we're going to miss out on Fuka's final rank. Oh, well. If you're heading out, do you want to stop by Polonia Mall together on the way home? Sure. Yeah. Let's get going. I want to have a quick little shop trip first, then check out the music store. Hey, what do you want to do now? Karaoke? Sure. Mommy? Where are you? A missing child? You mean at the police station that's been here this entire game? Come on, follow me. The policeman will know what to do. He'll find your mom, so don't worry. <sighs> what a relief. I'm glad he was able to contact the parents. What were they thinking leaving that poor kid all alone? I don't think they were thinking. Stuff like that really makes me upset. But... Although... When I used to work at a, at a store, when I was a manager at the store, people would leave their kids in the mall and just leave. Of any age. And just expect that they would be fine in the mall. And then they could just be little terrors. I had a, like a literal child, like literally they could not have been more than 11, buy a stink bomb from a Spencer's and then they threw it into my store. I was not happy. I guess my own mom's no different. What makes you say that? Why do you want to know? Sorry, I didn't mean to poke fun at you. Remember what I told you before? How my mom and I aren't very close? Well, if you ask me what kind of parent she is, I'd say a terrible one. She wasn't always like that, though. After what happened to Dad, she... Totally changed. She's probably living with one of her boyfriends somewhere. Honestly, I'd rather not know. Anyway, I'm done talking about this, okay? People deal with grief um, in mysterious can ways. You keep this between you and me. You're the only one I've told. Hikari has confided in me about her complicated relationship with her mother. It seems we've grown closer. Sorry, I'm not in the mood for karaoke anymore. Let's go home. I parted with Hikari and went back to the door. Welcome back. Sup, dude? Only three more days, man. I'm kind of looking forward to it, but also kind of not. Hey, 
I know I've given you some crap before, but I'm fully behind you now, dude. So let's give Nyx everything we've got. What do you say, Leader? Who's up here? Have I finished reading books with you? Uh... What are you doing? Oh. Do you want to continue reading that book? Um. Sure. All right. So the other day, I recommended the novel I'm reading to a classmate. I don't talk to her much, but at the time we were discussing a movie we'd both seen. She wasn't too keen on the recommendation and turned me down, though. It was because the series looked hard to get into. There are so many volumes. She's missing out. If she just gave it a chance, I know she would see how interesting it is. The basic premise is about journeying to other planets, and even that by itself already sounds intriguing. And the writing is so unique and poetic, I can't help but get sucked in. It's all a matter of if that's a genre she's interested in. Recommending something to someone is a really tricky thing, huh? Well... Thank you anyways. I appreciate you showing interest in that book. Okay, I think I'll read a little further myself. <sighs> I finished the whole thing. It looks like you're only halfway done. But if you say so. Time flies by so quickly. Let me know your thoughts on it next time. Well then, good night. Great classes over. Oh, we can finish Fuka. No, we can't. Dang it. <laughs> Crap. Whoops. Whoops. So much trash. I knew I should have gotten a persona of the Priestess Arcana. Just can't be bothered. Oh, I got 10K though. Well, we would have been able to hang out with oh, Fuka. You. Well, just two days left now. It's cold and dreary outside, and I couldn't blame you for feeling even drearier at the moment. But we need to just hang on a little while longer. Spring is just around the corner, as they say. Let's go on a walk with the dog. Everyone could come along for a walk tonight, yeah. Let's all walk the dog together. Uh-huh. Clothes shopping with me? Keep your voice down. <laughs> sure. Let's go together next time, Mitsuru Senpai. Go right, Fuka. Gotta go around from the right. Uh, okay. Huh? No, no, that's left. Oh, wait, that's right for you. Huh. Eh, whatever. Why don't you just climb to the top of the jungle gym? What? I'm not going down the slide head first. My clothes will get all dirty. And you might break your teeth. Now with your age, we used to compete over who could slide down in the funniest way. Funniest? Like what? Uh, you don't have to take your shirt off. It's fine. <laughs> Shake. <laughs> oh. Is shake the command given to request pause on one's head? It is now. <laughs> I comprehend. What a good dog. 
The day of the final battle draws near. Everyone is having fun, as if trying to make the most of this moment. We spent a pleasant evening together. Why was Akihiko trying to strip, though? I am so confused. Okay, class is over. Oh. Oh. We get another chance. Hey. We can hang out with Fuka. Hey. Oh, hi. I was thinking of returning to the dorm to cook. Would you like to join me? I'll be starting from scratch today. Yep, let's do it. <laughs> Great. This is going to be so much fun. I've already bought everything we need, so why don't we head back and get started? Okay, I think that does it for the gyoza filling. I thought it might be nice to add some texture, so I made sure there's plenty of vegetables mixed in. Um, do my choices matter? This is priestess. How bold. I don't think they do better. I'm a little worried, but I wanted to give it a try. We went by the book for the seasoning, so it shouldn't turn out too different. Next, we have to put the filling in the wrappers, but... Uh, where is she? Sorry I'm late. It was a long day of practice. Oh, have you gotten pretty far already? Welcome back. We were just starting on the wrappers. I invited Yukari-chan to join us. We were talking about cooking the other day, and she seemed really interested. Okay, the more the merrier. I mean, you almost never invite me to something like this, Fuka. So I was happy when you did. Have you changed recently, or is it just me? Have I? In what way? You just seem more at ease now. Or maybe it's more confidence. Don't you think so? Mmm... I agree. Yeah, see? That's what I thought. Really? Well, I'm glad if that's the case. He's been helping me a lot recently, and been really supportive of me. So I think maybe that's why. Wow! I guess that's our leader for you. Junpei ought to take some notes. Well, everyone has their own strengths. And I'm sure Junpei-kun has plenty of things he's good at, too. Yeah, I know. Not that I'd ever say that to his face, though, and go straight to his head. <laughs> oh, the gyoza wrappers are going to dry out. Let's start wrapping, shall we? Everyone finished wrapping the gyoza, and then we started cooking. I can hear them crackling pleasantly. Now I want gyoza. The gyoza are finished. They look delicious. Oh, wow, it's so good. How are yours, Yukari-chan? And the flavor and texture are perfect. I think this is the best gyoza I've ever had. There's plenty more white rice if you want, too. Oh, I would, but... Sorry, I actually gotta get going. I've gotta clean my archery uniform before tomorrow. Oh, you can leave my dishes. I'll clean them when I get back. <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. Besides... We'll save on water if we do them all at once. <sighs> Sorry about this. I'll make sure I can stick around till the end next time. But thanks for having me. <laughs> Did you notice she said next time? I was a little nervous at first, but I'm glad I challenged myself. Oh, that reminds me. I have something I wanted to give you. You're always listening to music, so I thought you might like these. Fuka's headphones. And I think you were a fan of this design, so I tried to match it. I replaced my old headphones with the ones Fuka gave me. 
The sound quality is unbelievably clear. Her technical skills must be next level. Oh, thank you. Remember how I told you I was what a pretty good with nice machines? Nice gift. Well, how are they? I love them. <laughs> pretty cool, right? Just kidding. Actually, I've decided I want to become more accepting of myself. I want to be able to say I'm proud of who I am. And I think this is the first step to reaching that goal. I'm going to be more confident in the things I'm good at. I hope you're happy with them. I could sense Fuka cares about me. I feel like we've forged a powerful bond. I'm skipping this part. Sorry. We just the sat through this, like, oh. twice today. Once today? Maybe just once today. The High Priestess Social Link reached its maximum level. You can now fuse... I... Skatach? Skatach? Skatech? I don't remember how you pronounce this name. Uh, the instructor. But I'm not going to give up on cooking either. I'll embrace the things I'm good at, but also find more things I can do. I'm going to change, one step at a time. Oh, if there's anything you decide you want to try doing, just let me know. I'll always be here to help. Thank you. I had a good time eating gyoza and talking with Fuka. Dog. Oh, hello there. Did you have a good day? It's almost time. It's been ten years since Death Awakened, and now finally tomorrow is the promised um. day. Once we enter Tartars tomorrow, we won't be able to leave. Are you ready? Yeah, as ready as I'll ever be. It is over. My dog is the only one that wants to hang out with me. I'm also starving, so I think I'm going to pause, go eat dinner, and then we will finish the game. Yeah. <laughs>